students are attending the University of Tampa this semester, but not many are familiar with the rich history behind the Henry B. Plant Museum and Plant Hall's role in the Tampa Bay Hotel. We interviewed Sally Shifke, the Museum Relations Coordinator, in order to find out more. The Tampa Bay Hotel opened in 1891, but Henry Plant came to Tampa in the early 1880s, and the Tampa Bay Hotel took three years to build to the tune of $2.5 million and another half a million dollars to finish. Henry B. Plant opened the Tampa Bay Hotel in 1891 and ran it until he passed away in 1899 at the age of 79. His heirs sold the hotel and the 150 acres it sat on to the city of Tampa in 1905 for $125,000. The city ran the hotel until 1932 during the Great Depression but the hotel was in decline and in need of repair. In 1933, the city of Tampa negotiated with the University of Tampa to move into the property and plant hall. As things began to break due to the age of the building, they started converting the dormitory rooms or the hotel rooms into classrooms and professor offices. On this 150 acres that Henry Plant owned, it was a resort. Whatever you wanted to do, it was here for your pleasure. You had a hunting guide that sat on 150 acres so you could go boat hunting, boating and fishing, golf, tennis. There was a, um, I think there was a bowling alley also. So we ended an indoor swimming pool. They had uh, tennis courts located right behind Plant Hall. In fact, the faculty parking lot is where the tennis courts were. And then right behind that, sort of where you would uh, lawn center, where it was the golf course. And then where the soccer field is, Henry Plant built a racetrack. So you had horse racing for his guests to enjoy. And then down on the water, you had a, a boathouse, which is uh, probably where the library is. Beyond that, he built what he called the casino. It was really a performing arts center. And it, it, it's, it sat almost 2,000 people. What makes the museum so special is that the majority of the collection is from the Tampa Bay Hotel. Who knew our university used to be a luxury resort? A lot has changed since Henry B. Plant first built the hotel, but the history will always remain here in Plant Hall.